And correlation is um, interesting in the sense that what traders look at is they look at correlation between different pairs. Uh, for example, the Swiss franc um, and the euro uh, against an, another pair, or the uh, euro uh, Japanese yen versus the uh, Great British pound yen, things like that. What happens is, is currencies sometimes move in unison with other currencies, and sometimes they move in opposite directions, and that's called a correlation value. And uh, people model them differently, but uh, basically uh, a one would be it's completely correlated, a 0.8 would be it's correlated about 80% and so forth. But the, the, the correct way to, to do that um, is, is to do that on the time frame that you're trading. And this is the mistake that a lot of new traders make. Uh, number one, they don't look at correlation, but if they do, they're looking at the wrong time frame. If you're trading on the daily chart, you should be looking at correlations on the daily and and the four hour chart.